Hello, 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 beautiful people. Welcome back to another Deadman Mode video. Today is the last day that we can actually still defeat the Breach monsters. So the plan for today is super simple. Get 99 attack, get 99 range, finish up higher prayer, and I'm gonna use some fairly risky methods that are leaked in my inventory right now. Hopefully, I can also get a couple more battles pieces for the team. And overall, we're gonna try our best to make the team as strong as possible for the 1v1s. There's only half of the competition online right now I'm gonna attempt in sold head prayer training method and hopefully not die in the process a little bit of late night gaming and I'm just trying to finish my 99 attack and 99 defense and 99 range as the last stats before the last breach I just decided to continue on my neck real task I mean I get a lot of good drops here we need coins we get soft clay and as you can see I'm getting very decent XP per hour as well so let's get a couple of levels at the night time and then I'll fully talk to you again in the morning up to 92 attack and 120 combat, one of the highest levels in the game, and I didn't even train prayer yet. Good morning, I'm about to finish this blue dragon task. I decided to range all the way throughout, simply because I needed range XP, and I got two levels in the process and a ton of dragon bones. I only use Dorgi, simply because we don't have enough bolts to throw away at the moment, which is a little bit unlucky, but it wasn't even too bad. But if you go ahead and look at my bank where I lose on death, let's just make sure we do not die. But before we continue, Buddha Dev is back to sponsor another video. Their mission is to teach you how to program. They focus on the backend development and they specialize on Python and Go programming languages. The best part about them is the fact that they make learning extremely fun. As you are learning, you'll be gaining XP, levels, achievements, and you will be finishing quests, making the whole learning process feel amazing. The folks over at the Buddha Dev believe that the smartest way to code is to make sure that you are never bored. So they created an online, self-paced platform that basically feels like a captivating RPG game. Buddha Dev will get you writing a ton of code, as they believe that getting your hands on the keyboard and shipping projects is the only way to learn. What I like the most is the fact that if you do not have the means to pay for a membership, you can still enjoy all of their content for free in read and guest mode. However, if you do decide to pay for a membership, you will unlock the interactivity and the game that comes with it. So, if you're interested in learning how to code, make sure you check the link in the description and you use my code MikaRS. That will give you 25% off your first month or your first year, depending on the subscription of your choice. I will continue to learn how to code and I am looking forward to seeing some of you guys join me along the way. Thank you so much to Buddha.dev for sponsoring today's episode and let's get right back into it. So by changing my spellbook on this, I should be able to, in theory, master reanimate this dragon. I just need to be very careful because my inventory is very bad. Uh, and I should be able to just save spot this, right, with my trident. And then I'm just hovering the tab and I can just get out of here. If I see any red dots. And look at the XP drop, 31,000 prayer XP for one dragon. Always one of my favorite ways to train prayer in deadman mode. And the Abyssal Demon gives us 26,000 XP as well. Very 76, just one more level to go for the level we fully need, but since I got so many bones over the night, I'm gonna ask if somebody from my team is down to support me a little bit and let me use all those bones on the Wilderness Altar. Every single time I play Deadman mode, I for some reason forget to pick up all my insult heads. I'm just like, mm, yeah, I'm most likely never gonna be using those. And then every single Deadman mode, I end up using all of my insult heads that I made. So, uh, yeah, there is a 77 prayer. Theoretically, prayer is now fully completed. However, I want more. I don't really get anything from getting prayer higher than 77. But I want to look cool. So that's why I'm doing it. And everybody else is already 77 prayer. So that should be no problem at all. And we'll finish it off on 78 prayer for now. And I do have all of those bones still in my bank. We have a very clear plan as to how we want to play the remaining of this tournament. And I need to make my team money. So it's going to be two things, Revs and Zolra. I'm going to start off by milling Revs because our web weavers are logged off. So I'm going to work on 99 attack and defense. But how am I going to do that? Well, you're going to notice in my deposit box, there is still a Kraken Tentacle. The last Kraken Tentacle that I have farmed. We lost both of the other twos. And now that I have VLS guaranteed, we're going to be combining this and using this for the rest of my training. Make the revs as fast as possible. Did I just spawn this by myself? Can I even kill this? 
by myself. I literally spawned it on my very first KC. So I guess I need to move away from that. Okay, so this thing has a lot of HP. I'm gonna try to kill it though. Because I think it's guaranteed, what is it, guaranteed 500k? Also, what happens if I tab out? Does it stay? So many questions I have no answers to. I might need to bank literally after one kill though, but I'm sure it's fine. Come on, buddy, cough it up. There it is. Big kill. I don't even know what I just dropped. Ancient emblem, 500k worth though. Ref cave TPs, magic logs, a bunch of stuff. But let's quickly go to the bank. That's 500k. Not really ideal. I need to resupply because uh, I literally had no charges. That is a first nice drop. Dragon long swords. It drops like these that we need because we need to make so much money for all the onyxes we want to make. So it's gonna be a very long day at revs, a lot of training, but money has to be done. Our very first bracelet is on the floor. We're gonna be needing a lot of those to alk to make a bunch of money. There is 93 attack. If I look for about 1.3 mil XP an hour, we're looking at about what, five to six hours for the attack and then an extra two hours for the defense. First inventory is basically done, but in the future, I'm gonna be a little bit more selective as to what I pick up. As you can see, I picked up a lot of Adamant bars and I don't think we need that many, but 500k from the first trip. That's a cool drop. We got a little Dragon Medhelm, completely useless, but we'll take it for the Alex, I guess. What a trip. We now have 600k more to the collection. Okay, we just spawned another boss. I want to see if I can do it now that I have a bunch of ether. Ooh, more Dragon Longsword's big. So, guaranteed 500k here. Let's see if I take damage. I do take damage, but just one. 10. No, I still take same damage. Hmm, I don't know if this is the play to kill this guy then. See, like right here, I'm so low on supplies. I think I'll bank and I'll come back because I don't want to go into bruise. We don't got a lot of bruise. That's the big issue. And I was set up with a lot of restores for the sake of doing a very long trip. Also, 492k in this trip. Very good. Yeah, lots of supplies to kill this guy, but guaranteed money is guaranteed money. And let's take a look here. Could be big. Oh, that's a Miller. We take the Miller. Very good. Nice, nice, nice. Very, very good. Okay, let's bring money to Mats right now and keep on going. That's crazy. His oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> no. Dude, look at the reaction time. Look at the reaction yeah, good, time. I like it. I like it. Time, I see someone come up. I just... That is a goat reaction time, actually. <laughs> Sorry. I rate that from that, man. What the hell? Dude, the best to ever do it, man. Bro, I'm literally going to have no food. Dude, minus <laughs> two food. Time. <laughs> minus three. <laughs> I'm not sure if I really explained why we need money as a team. So here's a very quick explanation as to why I will be spending so much time at refs today and then later on on Zolra as well. So first of all, we need five Furies. The way you get a Fury is by spending about three point something million buying Chaos Runes and then selling those to the shop. So just for the Furies, I need over 15 million coins for every single member. On top of that, we also want to make five sufferings, so there is five more onyxes there, so basically that's why we are doing it, and since we need to get 99 attack defense anyways, this is the best place for us to do it. But as soon as we are done with melee and range training, after that, Zolra will be the best spot, simply because we can actually drop straight up onyxes on Zolra and then skip the whole process of making money. Another trip, another 740k. 95 attack. I'm seriously considering getting one defense level, so let's go ahead and do that just for this 300k XP. Then we're gonna go back to attack till 99. Okay, we got another boss which is guaranteed 500k. So just to put it in perspective for the viewers, this takes about 45 minutes to spawn, sometimes 50 minutes. We're on the third one and there was 97 defense, meaning it is now time to start training attack to 99. Because defense I'll be training with magic still as I'm doing other things. Uh, but there it is, let's take a look, what do we get? Oh my goodness, okay, so we got emblem, what is this, 500k emblem, rune war hammers, uh, spider eggs, so supply drop on top of that, and we got mahogany planks. Um, pretty good, I mean, we'll take it, and now I can just stay here because I just banked, perfect. First sigil, sigil of the melit, what? Sigil of the Meticulous Mage, and uh, I have too much loot, huh? Uh, so let's get rid of that. So those sigils, I don't think are gonna be that useful anymore. Simply because I got a bunch of tier 5s, so it should be sorted. Uh, but I'll still take it, because that is free potions, basically. And this inventory looks to be about 880k. Wow. Another trip, 500k. 
we finally have our hands on the web weaver and the XP per hour should be very, very good. Honestly, do I even kill this or do I move on to something else? I feel like I'm killing them too fast. Yeah, I literally need to wait for spawns. The DPS goes crazy. Should take me about an hour or two to finish 99. Okay, do we get something big here? Oh, it's so good to actually get range XP though. I should be able to stay and just get more food, right? Shouldn't be an issue. Okay, so we're just... Oh, 1 million. Nice, nice, nice. A million, the better possible reward there. We'll take it. Very good. And now I can eat it up as well. Perfect, the drop. Very nice. Even more money. There it is. I absolutely love this weapon. Here's 96. Three more levels to go. Getting 1.7 mil XP an hour. And that includes, obviously, banking time. If I was just shooting here, it would probably be upwards of 2 million an hour. That is the very first Dragon Plate Skirt in 270 kills. That's one of the best drops you can get on a regular table. I missed the last trip, but here is 730k with a D Plate Skirt and two D Longs on top of that. We are printing right now. I'm gonna stay here till 99 range and I'm sure we have enough money at that point. 840k from this trip. So you're telling me I can pull this boss to like the tunnel and then long range it. Now this long range technology is not it, let me tell you. Okay, we got the 500k one. I got two Karamb ones and one Super Restore. That has to be yeah, worth it. Yeah, it's actually pretty big. There might be a little storm brewing outside, but we get 1.2 million in this trip. Look how beautiful this looks. Just a bunch of rune items and bracelets and an emblem and a dragon mad helm here. Boom, 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 boom. What do I lose if I die right now? Oi, oi, oi. That's a lot of money. Another 500k. Well, it wouldn't be me if I didn't miss 98 range. Uh, one more level to go. It's been it's been good. You can see 3 million, about 2 hours we've been here. And still maintaining 1.6 million an hour. Meaning, we'll be done in about 40 minutes if everything goes smoothly. And we also made approximately, I'd say over 10, 12 million straight up cash in profit through this journey. So, one more level to go. Let's push through it. 700k in this one. And now we're just gonna finish off the boss as well. Ooh, nice. A miller. Very good. We got the better version, so 1 million extra coin. And another trip completed for 1.4 million. I'm gonna now offload all the loot we made to Mutt so he can start alking it, buying Chaos Runes, and then transforming that into Furies and Sufferings. What a session it has been, and I'm not fully completed just yet, but... Uh, it's gonna be an interesting price check regardless. This is a quick reminder to let you know that you should probably subscribe. So, if you ever wondered what it looks like to do revs for a little bit of time uncontested on Deadman mode, here's how it looks like. Oh, I also have like Onyx bolt tips and Dragonstone bolt tips. I'm definitely missing some, some loot, but just like quickly looking at a bank and grabbing stuff out, it looks a little like this. So this is just straight cash with nothing. Oh my god, 2.5 million in just bracelets. So 6.6 .6 millions is just straight up Alex. So that's two Onyxes right here. And then on top of that, one extra million in this. On top of that, two extra million in this. So that's 10 million, just raw cash, straight up coins. And then we probably have some other small drops. So this is gonna help team big time. That should be three Onyxes and a little bit. And I'm not done yet because I will be going back. So that is very good. And I'm probably missing something very obvious as well. Yeah, all the rune drops as well that we could turn into even more money, so we're looking good. So if we add on that, the extra loot that we're not really doing too much with is like 1.3 mil. So like, what a what a session, man. Really good. So there we go, 12 million on the low end without all the other drops as well. That's a lot. Yeah, that's a lot of money, no? That's like three onyxes and then... Yeah. Four. Four, actually. So that's two people fully set up in like suffering and onyx. Big. Yeah. Enjoy alking, buddy. Have fun time, my Yay. friend. <laughs> 1.2 million in that trip, and I do think we have just one more to go. But there it is. The big 99 range completed. Very cool. We now just have a couple of attack and defense levels to go. Uh, but honestly, no rush. Even if I went into tomorrow's fights with these sort of stats, I would be very happy. Um, I'm going to probably prioritize defense first and then leave it the rest till attack. Um, but let's be honest, I want to be maxed out in every possible skill. Uh, so the last trip, as said, 700k. We have now officially made over 15 million and we bring it home. Very good. Another 99 completed. So I was thinking when we train prayer, we just go up as five and we just, uh, like, they can also destroy a looting bag for us. I wanted yeah, to go a bit sure. over, but, like, we might as well use those bones, I feel like.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is where the teamwork comes in clutch. Mats is alking while training melee, giving me the coins. I'm now responsible to buy a lot of chaos runes and that will then turn into furies. And then all of us will have furies for the end and sufferings. So that's what I'm doing with all this cash. It's all going to these chaos runes. Officially bought 55,000 chaos runes. Let's bring it home. Uh, and then we go and do a little bit of melee training on black dragons just to finish off the last few levels and maybe land on a DFS, which is a one in 1000 something drop. So very rare. We probably won't get it, but it's something we might as well look into. So the super secret spot we're going to be spending a little bit of time at is these black dragons right here in Taverly. Just going to be chilling here. I have a ladder right next to me. Very easy escapes. I got freezes. We should be chilling. Uh, but yeah, I'll be here for a bit uh, whilst trying to get my attack higher and defense higher. I'm going to start off on defense. And we'll see how much XP per hour we get. I don't assume it's going to be great. I might swap between these and Wyverns. But uh, we'll see. I don't know which ones are better. The XP per hour should not be too high. But we're just hoping on the fact that we land on the DFS. And that's basically one of the last things I need to work towards. Aside from fixing a 99 attack and 99 defense. Decided to quickly bury the last of the bones. We are now 80 prayer enjoyer. I don't think it really matters. Oh, it does actually. 1-2-2 two, two combat. Would you look at that? I still need to get 2 defense levels and 4 attack levels. How much XP am I missing? 200. I think I could get 81, but like I don't want to go back to wildy, but I could just manually bury all these bones. I might as well do that while I'm waiting for a breach, I'm gonna be honest. <clears throat> Guys, do you want to start walking already? Just imagine as if it was a... Uh... No, yeah, G. come to the tunnel. Come to the other side of the tunnel. I'll meet you at the tunnel. Just middle of the middle of the Zia. I'm looking center. Nobody is center. Meet me in the castle, okay? Nobody is castle. Castle is saves on those. So if you're school, hey, don't watch out much. Move, Are we move, using the minecart? Uh, no, we we walk, we run. Just come to the center when you can. Apparently, it's really easy to single to multi. Yes, this it area. is. It is. It is. Okay, this is where we need your yeah, expertise. Fall in. Like just house stab or TP. Like yeah. yeah. Yeah, we'll get there first. Or grab coins and cart, you can get right in the middle of it. Like Winter Todd, uh, cart, straight in there. It's okay, we lose five minutes though, so we have to, like, honestly, I think we commit to the breach here. What do you think, yeah. Dino? Yeah, so, so far. Um, same plan, again, same plan. We'll focus on PVM in, and when the breach starts dying out, I really do want to start pushing teams. But we will focus on PVM in for as long as it's feasible keep that in, makes sense keep in mind there is a bank on the a little bit north of the farm okay so if you like really need to tank or some shit you can bank there for free we're only three minutes late so all right so this should be right under here so spread now and we look to single to multi and i guess it should be somewhere here yeah raise in multi they're all in multi should we hit no 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 um yep look are we prime. In singles here? yeah yeah here is singles but a bit multi like you can look at Bodhi. It's Bodhi and Bodhi. Yeah, it's hit yeah. Bodhi. I've got Bodhi frozen. Pile Bodhi. Pile okay, Bodhi. Pile Bodhi. I'm done. Declamp. Just got Bodhi. Yeah. You oh, kill Bodhi. Smite up. Look for NPCs. I'm going with a spear. Careful we don't get single to multi. No, there. get out, get out. Single to multi. Get back to single. Get back get, to single. Get, 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 out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. I'm frozen. I do not know where the multi line is. That's Just come north, come north. Guys, away, we need away, to wrap around. Can we pull to the right here? Pull to the right? Yeah. Oh, come east. You good, Matt? Yes. I'm going to try to get prime. There, there's a team in there. Yeah. Oh, Reese's team's in there. Like, deep Honestly, deep. just go down. It's just one sword on the block. Let's go. Run in, run in and kill. Run in and yeah, kill. Go, 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 Everything go, 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 Oda. Go, go, everything go, go, Oda. Why, 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 why? Reese's on his own there. I can't see Oda block though. Oh, wait, there's Iliop team in there as well. There's so many mobs here. Okay, just go okay, Reese. Just go Reese. Just go Reese. Fuck it. But guys, there's solo mission team in the middle. Completely caught off guard. Just pile Reese and then we'll go for solo missions team. Can blitzing. No one's here contesting. Get the smites up. He took his prayer off. He took his prayer Single off. Single target spells. Single target spells. I'm just running around like a moron. Hold on. Catch a re. Catch a re. Catch a re. Barrage is now. Frozen. Frozen. Big, frozen. Frozen. Big, big frozen. Big no, Wait. it's not. Okay. Oh, Wait. Oh, Wait. Keep going. What? You can. Oh my. What the fuck? You just okay, pull off. Pull off no, the not gonna like that. No, that last spear I did. Yo, focus it. on focus on cave abomination here. From single to multi cave abomination. We can st just pump pump damage here. We also want to hit stuff that's like only us are hitting. So we're oh. all in singles. Yes, this is all singles. Yeah. After, let's all go Z Ziliana, so we keep a mob to ourselves. By the way, Dino, you still have a spear. Yeah. In case we uh, see anyone with like a bow or anything. Yeah, everything's Zili, everything's Zili. This is an awful position for a breach. Wait, Rexy, Goblin! You... Goblin! Uh, stand Zili, stand Zili, stand Zili. Zili first, then Goblin. 
yeah, yeah, not gonna lie, this is a really shit spot for a last breach. Yeah. So now I think because it's just single, I think we just focus on PvE, honestly. It's shit, oh, yeah, but... I mean, yeah, I guess. Guys, guys, let's get this Zilly down. Only we deal damage um, to it, so... What did Oda get? You said he got a drop. VLS, he got. He got. VLS. Yeah. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's one drop we didn't want him to get, to be honest. Yeah. Uh, look, uh, Gradron, Gradron right. Just go for Gradron. Uh, we can oh, go for Gerwin, maybe? Yeah, yeah if free, you pull free. it, if you pull it, yeah. I don't no, you, 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 you can add that one, you can add that one. Yeah, on long range you can, from single. After that, all Gradar, by the way. Yeah, Pandos, all of us, after. Like, Peep right now is speedable, if you want to go for it. If you want to free spear Peep, and then we all pile Peep. Look for him, look for him. Yeah, just spear him to multi, and then I'll barrage. I'm ready. Go, 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 He's go, being go. barraged. Okay. Just Peep, Peep, Peep. Make sure you don't spam it. One more. Uh, you spammed it. One more. Oh, fuck, it's me. I'm sorry. What? Uh, oh, what my I FF. That? That's awkward. <laughs> okay, whatever. Wait, I'm muted in Discord. Does it not work oh. in Dead Man? No, you, you can't spam the spear. Oh my god, this breach is. Guys, come with me. Fuck it, this is so boring. Just come to the right. Come to the right. Yes, yes, yes. Come to the right, then south, and we're gonna go in multi, by the way. Oh, watch out. But this is guys, multi. These though. guys are Be watching careful. us as well, so. Uh, wait, three, spread, two, one, right, run right, run right, run right. We pull them to multi. Don't, don't clump, though. Don't clump. And now, Reese okay, good, 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 good. Oh, no, he's not, he's and now go okay, south with me. Go south. And then if so, if they come to us, we, we we pile. We do two two line gaps, and now range pre and Kriara, and we pull it to us. If they want to contest us here, guys, just two spaces between ourselves, and if anything goes, we go. Yeah, it's really good. I think like look, it's the last fucking breach. We might as well play aggro, and then who gives a fuck, right? We are definitely gonna get rushed, but if we can snag like a VLS, it's worth it. So here's what we need to do. Whoever gets VLS, all four of the other people's top priority is to freeze others Survive. that are running in. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. It's like Keep them alive. Yeah, it's like protect the president type vibes. Dude, we're pulling the whole server to us, by the way. Be careful. More east, KBD is gonna melt us all if we stay like this. That that's good, that's good. Now back to Kriara, the Diagrot. Come back. We have good spot here again. It's good, it's good. It's not bad, by the way. Are we they, can still get just, a lot. Oh, the there's just left, Kizard, by the way. Orcasar is lurking. That's fine. Just keep the, keep the space between. Maybe come further south here where I'm standing. Oh, n never mind. KBD is here. <laughs> uh, after this, Mage Prey. And now KBD. Mage Prey and now focus KBD. Trinket, Trinket Wesson. Nice. Trinket, nice. Beautiful. Honestly... I've been tanking this. Guys, just kill the KBD. I've been tanking we, we this kill KBD, KBD forever. Just kill KBD fast. We can freeze. We can freeze. Here. Yeah. yeah, and then you just run into single. Ah, oh, never mind. They pulled it back. Are they literally Can I get some supplies, single? Mats? Can I get some supplies? I thank this KBD forever. Yeah. Quickly. Just Bruce. 50 Morgans on Port Kazard. Try well, to jump to him if he comes. That. Yeah, we jump Port Kazard if he comes. After this, look for the new spawn right now. Look, Bandos. Bandos uh, next, honestly. They, they just tell you grabbed it. They tell you grabbed yeah, something, it's fine, it's fine. yeah. We still have good amount of kills. We can continue this. It's still spawning new mobs. After this, we push left. We see if there's any mobs. I, th I see Kriara shooting. I'll go, I'll go yeah. see if I can grab something real quick. Yeah, we don't really want Kriara on us, okay? Yeah, any mob at this point, I'd say. Uh, the breach is done, I believe. Okay, let's push uh, left together man. and see I if see, we find I still, something. I still see the breach Kriara is still on the... I've got a Zillia. I've got a Zillia. You guys come west. Okay, I see you. Yeah, let's go Zillia and after it, there's Supreme still. So solo mission, if, the both I think if we don't push them, I think they're gonna Okay, do you want a 3 to 1 push it? Can After the... No, oh, kite, can, kite it right, kite it right. Dude, yeah, really we don't low, push bro. then. Kite it to the right, we don't fight. We're really low food, yeah. We kill this and we hope it's a VLS. Yeah, it's over. What an awful block. last break. Yeah, but we killed... It wasn't awful, we just didn't get lucky, right? Like... No, 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 but I mean it's an awful location. Not oh, like yeah. us being bad. Yeah, that, yeah. Just uh, really bro, bro, bad bro, bro, location. Yeah, just DP out. Castle Wars. Uh, they're still lurking, by the way, so we make sure a dino gets out. Donna, you go first. Yeah, mate. just uh, Castle yeah, Wars. I'm, I've started Castle Wars for six seconds. Uh, Castle Wars, there's West Ham, it's safe. Unfortunate on the drops, guys. It w That is a poor place for the last one. Yeah, not gonna lie, that was a very anticlimactic end. Yeah, again, nothing like, nothing we done wrong. Mika, you was doing sick calls. It Thanks. was just a really bad spot. Like, yeah, everyone was in singles. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, unfortunately, without a VLS, without a Zuriel staff, without any PvP weapons in this breach, even though we got a lot of kills, we didn't get very lucky, and that is okay, meaning we're gonna be entering the 1v1 stages with three VLSs, 
and three Zuriel staffs. We're gonna have to see how we're gonna spread stuff around and the rest of the time we have approximately 20 hours till the end of the tournament and I'm probably gonna spend most of it in chambers with the boys but maybe I will do some other things. I'll definitely finish 99 defense and attack before tomorrow. Um, so that might be there for tomorrow's video. If you guys wanna see one more video before the final, make sure you leave this video a like, make sure you comment and consider subscribing. I will do my best to post another video tomorrow but if there is not enough content then we will just post the video as the finals drop. That being said have a beautiful end of your day and I'll see you again either tomorrow or the day after that with another video. Have a good one and bye bye.